Hey guys, check this out. We just got this, what I believe is to be a Fowler's Toad, which is pretty cool because I actually don't see the Fowler's Toad that often. And how I can tell it's probably a Fowler's Toad is the spots on the back here, the warts in the spot, they usually have three to four warts per pigmented spot while the American Toad has one to two. Also, the coloration, the patterning is a little bit different. Uh, which I know it's, sometimes it can be pretty difficult to distinguish between the Fowlers and the American Toad, but that's a couple ways of doing it. But he's pretty cool. He's definitely given us quite a bit of fight because we were trying to photograph him before. He's making a little bit of squeaking noise too, which leads me to believe that he's a male since when you grab them like this, by the sides they tend to make that call to let you know that they are male. And that's pretty much what they do during the breeding season. If another male grabs onto another male, then they'll make that call to say, hey, I'm a guy, pretty much. But he's really cool. And I'm sure we stressed him out enough, so we're going to go ahead and release him and see what else we can find today. Watch him jump onto my face. I know, right? <laughs> All right, so guys, check this out. This is actually a pretty rare find for me. I've actually never seen one of these before in person, at least in uh, Connecticut, which is really cool. This is actually a northern walking stick. And these are chilling out on some of these plants over here. And we're actually getting a little bit of rain down on us, but this is just an awesome find. They're so well camouflaged, you could actually walk right by them and not even, whoop. <laughs> 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 it's kind of jumpy, but he's, they're actually so well camouflaged you could just walk right by them and not oh even see them. But I actually managed to spot this guy. He's really cool. You can see why they're called stick insects because they're so stick-like and they blend in so well. It's really awesome. Well, we're going to go ahead and put him back because we're actually getting a little bit of rain and really don't want to get the camera wet, so <laughs> we'll see you guys later.